Hello fellas and welcome back to Factorio. Now, uh, in the last episode, I did say I was going to get the processing units on the, uh, down here, where the red ones are and the green ones are being made, but... Um, what is it? No, this one. It's down here. That's research. Down here, but unfortunately, we're not going to get that on. And this is why. Because this is all the coal we have left, excluding the bits that's on the belts and the little bit up there. And the little bit that's feeding the oil down here. But other than those, <coughs> this is all that's essentially feeding um, the furnaces, but both sets of furnaces. The furnaces up the top for steel. Goes all the way down to be used in coal down here as well for using coal for explosives and things and grenades and things like that. So all that's being used. Copper should last us a little while yet. But it's going to start getting very hectic once the um, the processing units get the um, the processing circuits get made. But uh, this is going to go out very shortly. <coughs> this will last a little bit longer, but it is slowly draining from back to front. But we need coal and quite a bit of it. I have spotted a nice patch of coal. Um, We've got a couple of patches here. We've got one here available to us now, and we have one up here available to us now. <coughs> Sorry. But we've got a nice chunk here, a nice chunk there. Uh, down here is where the main of it is. We've got a bit there, a bit there, a bit there. There's four slots here, there, 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 there. But look at all of this that there is. So what I want to do first is I want to get some coal on to sort this out. Next episode, I want to get some processing units on and try to get some of the... Um, try and get the modular armor in the next episode because what I want I want to get that that modular armor to get this oil and hopefully this oil down here so we can funnel this along and I'll probably make it a a train system down here and block it off and sort of loop it back to the top of this so it'll be going down the bottom end of Australia mm. but what we really need to do now is get some coal so we're gonna do that now, but before we do do that, yeah, I'm going to put a light here because it's very dark. Come on, get to it. There we go. Oop, two. Okay, I need to work out which one is forwards. <coughs> now then, what I want to do is I want to get us a place to put some of the um, thingy in. Um, oh, save. We need a, um, to essentially see where coal's gonna end up because we want to get this coal here down into this area and this point is just sending a belt through because it's it's it, it won't be it, yeah it'll work and it'll be quick enough but it's just i reckon it'll be easier to train it down here so what we need to do is we need to get a train system and i've oh, there's some research so what we want to do i want to get this power armor because this is the one i want to make i want to skip modular and go straight to power because we can just about work this one and this will um we could get this one and this is the second to last the last one's here which we can't do because we need the um efficiency modules and they'll take some time i think so we're going to get some power armor on next now uh the train system i want to essentially stop it here and what I'll do, when essentially all this coal is finished down here, I'll literally just rotate all this belt round the opposite direction. Probably speed it up as well. And we'll, um, this will be gone very shortly. There's hardly anything there. That's virtually gone. So I'll, we'll need to get... I'll put some of um, new um, electric in. Some, a lot, another set of this. I'll double it up in the next... In, probably in the next episode as well. If we have time or before then between the episodes but um we want a train station here now we want it relatively close so about here is a relatively decent area i reckon so we want to send this up here now how far can we go with this uh that's got to go up there hmm right so we need some flam fill luckily i have made some uh, if you press the plus on your, if you have a number pad and you press the plus key, it'll increase the size like it does with the um, the flooring, um, and it's exactly the same with the minus key as well. Yeah, let's just max it out for now, and I want to just do that and probably need a bit more than that actually. Hopefully that sh may do it. Have a look. 
Mm, that should about do actually, yep. Yeah. Uh, we need to, need to move that. There we go. <clears throat> Down here. And I want it to go through here. And we can remove these because we don't need those. There's a load of trees in the goddamn way as well. Oh crap. I thought I had the um, shotgun on. There we go. Don't need these trees. I burned down this the, um, because it was, it was annoying. It was in the way. I know I needed to get rid of it, so I did. <clears throat> yeah, shotgun's very decent to getting rid of trees and stuff. There, that one. I can go, can't get it. There we go. <clears throat> That'll do for now. There we go, guys. Sorted. Right. Now then. Um, uh, want the tree, we want the train tracks to come essentially through here. Because we want to get to there. And what I'll do, I thought... I did go essentially sort of around the top of here. But that's... It's a stupid idea. And I did say think of going up here. But again, that's a stupid idea. Because we can go straight through. By that I mean... Through there. I reckon that's a better place for us to just send the trains through because it's a straight line then. Now, um, unfortunately, due to the amount of space, I can't quite fit a, um, a, what you call, oh, power arm's done. So after power arm, the next thing I want will be the, uh, the fusion. And this will essentially give us uh, 75 kilowatts of power to essentially use to all this other stuff like all these so it cost a bit of power this one costs 200 kilowatts so that's going to take up just so just under a third of a, of a fusion reactor and we've already got the solar panels as well so we can use a few of these if need be the problem is they're a bit expensive this one's got pr one processing unit for one one of them and five solar panels and i haven't got them automated yet i should get them on i should have got them on ages ago really but Fusion reactor it is. Go. Right, I want to get this down here to begin with. So let's just throw that there. Now then. Um, <clears throat> at this precise moment, I think the best thing for us to do would be to just the... Um, I can't pop that there. Let's go there. And hopefully I can just fit that to that. Uh, it's not quite... Uh, oh, one less. Not that. That. That's what I'm after. Got there eventually. There. Now, if I put a station there, uh, that's the latest we go. If I hold, hover over it, we can't quite fit two on there. So we need to move this up. It's got to go further upwards. Uh, get rid of that. <clears throat> so we need to sort of set it up an extra. Will one do? E yes, one will do that. So that's as high as it needs to go. Yeah, throw that one there. And that will now fit both of those on. Yep, that will fit them on just enough. So now I can belt this. Well, I could, but that's in the way. Let's remove those. And that's still too high. So let's get some more landfill out. Nope, uh, tracks there, and I need the other side doing. Oh, yeah, yeah, that should do. <clears throat> well, don't know waste it because it's not as cheap as you think. It is 20 stone, but my stone's not exactly the most reliable thing. So let's go down here then, and I can go there. I need to get it down here, so let's send it straight down. I'm going to stop it there for now. And I want the um, this track to essentially mirror that. So I can go there and then this way. Then I want it to go up to there. That's where I want it. Perfect. There. And the reason why I'm making this a circular one is because I might be able to get two trains in this. Which will help a lot. Um, let's get some lights down here. Bump. 
Bump. Bump. Bump. Bump. Oh. No, not bump, bump. Just bump. There we go. <clears throat> so this is the coal area we, we want. And what I'm going to do, I'm actually going to use these long ones to get us a decent distance from the electric poles up here. If I put this one... No, it won't go just yet. It's got to put one there. And then th that will fix to both now. As you can see, back line to both sides. And we'll get this on. <clears throat> now we need a train state. We need a train station down here first. So I can't quite fit them there. So we start this side. And we need one there. That's where our train is going. Now I want this to essentially take up the least amount of space as possible. But it's going to take some more landfill. Do that. Can I turn that around now? Yes, perfect. Right, need to take that one off. Uh, this is gonna. Oh, I can just sit, cinch it through there, but this is gonna take that out <coughs> there and there. Right, that's done. That that's perfectly fine. Let's replace that. Um, there we go. Put that light back down as well. God, I'm so. I need to get close to stuff. There. And now we'll have the train station just here. This will be where the train station goes. There. There. And then this will need to go to there. So let's see. Um, go to that one and get rid of that one. And then this can... Oh, oops. This can follow it. Uh, no, not that far down. <clears throat> right, I need to back one of them up. There. There we go. No. Oh, I'm out. Where did I put my car? Um, if I press map, it's not too far. It's only there, so. Let's go grab some train tracks. <clears throat> In fact, while I'm here, I'm going to rename this to not Viridium or Ver Verdum or D Verdium or whatever it's called. It's now called Coal. Outpost 1, not 12, 1. The reason why I'm calling it 1 is because we're probably going to... Well, that's a bit quick. I'm probably going to get some of this lot. Because look at all that lot. That's a nice big giant patch there. That'll last us a long while. But I'm going to need to take these up and bring them one way or another. So when I get with these, the, uh, when I get this, this oil here, I'll probably also make this a two-way track as well. So they can they can have a cycle rather than clogging if you have a, if you have a shuttle yes it can work but you can only really have one train on it and oh it's collected enough once blimey that's a miracle um so yeah we want to take this over and here that's a bit too far i need to put the station there i'll do <clears throat> Got some tracks in here. Ah, the fusion power has done. So the next thing I'll want on this will be the exoskeleton. And let's start with that. That'll make us run a bit faster. Right, um, just get a stack of that, I'll do. Just one. Should be enough, just one then. And let's just see, um, finish the track we need. Sorted. And that's the train track done. And let's get the, um, the coal. Whoop. Again, too far a goddamn way. There, and then this one can be, if I go to here, if I click that one, I can just change. Oh. Yeah, I can't double click it to thingy. This will be. Um, yeah. Oh, no, this is the outpost. This one needs. Yeah. Outpost one. The other one needs changing. I'll change that at some other point. But you can have multiple. So you can have multiple ones, but I'll change that drop. In fact, I could do it from here, can't I? If I go to trains, no, I can't go to trains because it's not, you know, no. ignore that, you can't. So yeah, what we need to do, we need to essentially put a train in here and figure out what we've got and where. So where's the train? There's one. Put that there. Oh, no, wrong right way. <clears throat> and I push, damn it. Train, that way. 
There we go. Right, we need to add a little bit of fuel to this. That should do for now. Color, I want this black. Black as it'll go. Zero, zero. Because black's like coal. And I want this to start at coal out that ah, angle. Oh, that, that was the um, <clears throat> exoskeleton. Now, I'm not going to quite get these on yet. Well, actually, no, I'll get this one on. The energy shield. This is essentially a barrier. But unfortunately, I need to change that other one because otherwise it won't quite work out where it's got to go first. If the station's called... If the stations are named the same, it will go to either of those stations and it won't really do a cycle. We want this as the um, outpost. It's ideal if you have like multiple pickups of a sec of a thing of a certain thing. So if you've got like a coal place like we're doing now, and you need and you've got two stations for two trains to pick up coal, that's where it'll help. And it's, that's how it works. I want this one to train change to drop off. Sorted. Should have been one little bit no matter. Right, let's go back. Actually, I'm gonna wire this back up just to just for ease of my OCD. Uh, that can only go to there. That's as far as that will go, and then this can be moved to there, and then this one can just I don't know. There, I'll do. Right, let's go this way. <coughs> right. Right, we've got this train. Right, we want it to go to outpost. Just do, we want to, when is it at this one? We want to make sure, we want to leave when the cargo that we're putting is full. So, but first, let's go automatic. Off. So now we know where they're all going to go. Let's just put in a couple of these. <clears throat> um, I think we can only, f the only reason why I'm putting two is because up here we can only fit two, which is a little bit unfortunate. But that's how it goes. And so what we're going to do here, the only thing we're collecting here is coal. So we don't need filter inserters. We could just put that in there. Don't need that one. I'll put those ones in there. I'm going to do exactly the same further down. There and there. And then we can get some chests. Again, as I said, it's ideal to do chests because it can fill them up while it's at... You could be able to fill up while it's at the other side. It's not so bad with this, but he... Um, with things like oil, it just take a bit of a thing. Uh, now, the next thing I want is probably this personal railway port. And um, we still need to get them on, unfortunately. But they're going to take a little bit longer. We should be able to get them on within the next three episodes or so. Depending on how we are. So, we want to. I want to get that one on at the moment. But we'll have to wait a little bit longer. Um, so, that's this train station set. So, let's just uh, do this. And then, right, you... In yeah, fact, then. But no. Go to drop off uh, until the inventory empty. So let's just go there. No take us there. <clears throat> and when, we, when it stops, I'll just change it to manual. There, manual, right. No, come out. There we go. Now this is the same. La thankfully, you can walk between these. Just don't do it when the train's going to move because it will kill you. And now we need to do the same as we did here. No, this one needs to be out though. There, there, not that one. Then there, again, not that one. And then there. And I want steel chests straight along there. Not this one, or whatever. <clears throat> there we go. Now, when the coal arrives this side, I do want it to be, um, I want it sort of evenly set up. So I'm going to do that and then put a, uh, I need, it does need to be balanced as well. So, hmm. Le yeah, let's do it like that. Put that there. And do the balancing trick as always that we, we've come to know and love. There and this event, this, oh, that was fast. Now, um, I am going to do some, ah, uh, this would be nice, but this doesn't work, this only works for stack inserters, and we don't have any at the moment, we need some advanced circuits for those, 
We do have them, I just need to put them in the right place. But um, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be doing this follow account. The reason being is, you know those um, these things we have, we can only get three. Yeah, we do more of that and we can get even more. And it goes up in sets of two, so this is plus two. I think you get a maximum of like 24 or something like that. It's something ridiculous. But I'm going to start getting some of these on. They do get very expensive, especially when you get right down to the end. The last one's 2600 which is a lot. But I want to get it at this precise moment because it's the um, it helps us defend ourselves, as it's known. But this is that's essentially all this bit done. I just to, um, attach this if I can. Want that there, there, and there. Let's just put a light in the just put a light on either side rather than the end. And then I can just attach this like that, and this will now empty them out. So let's go here and right i do want to change these as well i want to add a condition to this so for example if we're at, at the other end at this outpost out here and we're picking some up and let's say it stops but there's no for example maybe the electricity got cut off what would one what would i want to do if if it stops then we're stuck and we've got a load of coal here not being used so we want to um, add another condition for a um, your inactivity, not time passed, inactivity. If you use a time passed, it will wait for that time and then go. This will do it if something doesn't happen for so many for so many seconds. And I'm going to put it to about 20, and I'm going to press all. So if we do get a cutout and the car is not full, then we'll be able, then it will just leave and deliver them over here. Which is essential. I want. I want to do exactly the same on this side. So in activity, or for all, and then 20 seconds. I'll do that for both of these. So now I can essentially turn this on now. <clears throat> so nothing's happened, and it's going to go straight to the outpost, which is good because that's exactly what I want. And we're going to set this to stop. There. Get out. Now then. I want this coal electric mined out, so give me a few seconds to get this on. Okay fellas, so I've got this essentially set up, it's just not been turned on. I'll do that right now, just by clunking in there, and now it's all turned on and we'll start getting things. But I want to essentially split this between these two evenly, because I don't want it to just go down here, because this one will fill up down this back end, and this one will, and it'll take twice as long to fill up. So I want this to essentially get together, really. Um, so I'm going to do that one. And then this one. Then what you want to do here. <clears throat> see, yeah. That will essentially merge everything into one bundle. But um, when you, what you want to do as well after that is to put it straight into there. Because this will balance them like that. And now I can just do that. And then do that. And then that. They will now fill stuff when I've plugged them in, which I forgot to do. Like that, that, that. <clears throat> Thankfully this these go over the three so I don't I have to miss one out here and there. So that will now start filling up and I can so also one thing I want to do as well is do that. Why? Because eventually that will actually fill up this this is the um, locomotive on it eventually when I can actually get some coal down there. I'm going to just nick some so I can do it. Just to fill it up the first time. That'll do. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, I want that. Um, uh, fuel and just smack that in. That'll do for now and that'll last for a while and it'll feed it till, it, well, the coal runs out. And this is essentially done. I can now turn this on and I'm going to do it right now. So if I go to automatic 
and that's going to start and that's going to wait till either these are full or this or nothing happens for nothing happens for a while and that's a nice set of coal yeah um, now thankfully we've got that and um, well that was a bit stupid so what i'm gonna do hmm let's see hmm um, it's been half an hour's worth of episodes, but it's. I don't really want you to just see me plopping down a load of these. So. But, um. So, yeah, let's see what we've got around. I can't go that way. I think the problem with this now is driving down here, I've got to drive through there a little bit and onto the track, which isn't ideal, especially when a train comes. So, as a precise moment, we're doing okay for this. But, um, in fact, I know what we can do. We can get stuff ready for the, um, there you go. I had to concentrate there. For the uh, power armor, and I'm actually going to burn this down. Don't care about that. Burn down. Go away. Oh, don't stand in the fire. There we go. <coughs> That'll do. That was stupid. There we go. <clears throat> oh, crap. I've burnt the belts off. I didn't realize I'd burn away the belts. Okay, then. Um, right, no more fire. So if these are orange, you know that you have a, um, they're a bit broken. Orange ones are, well, yellow ones are broken. Orange ones are completely missing. That'll do. That'll be fine. Not bothered about them changing things. Let's get rid of the excess. Technically, if you was in here, you would choke to death because of all this smoke. But then again, it is above you, so. That bit, that bit. Sorted, right. Now then, um, go through here, down this bit. Right, I'm going to go through that bit there. Oop, don't, oh, no, damn it. Tried to miss it, didn't. There. <clears throat> Let's just uh, um, put them back on. Well, fix them, not put them back on. Uh, it should be okay. For, ah, that's what I need. Them. See, well, I need to get the red circuits up here, which is going to be a bit of a pain in the ass. Um, I don't know how I'm going to do that. Because um, um, I need red circuits for this. So it's not going to be easy. Um, what? A, hmm, that's an idea, idea of four way to do. Hmm. Right. I have had an idea. I'm going to move that one. Put it there instead. Because yes, I can get them here. I've figured it out. I can get them. However, no, I'm going to put them facing that way. Oh, not with that there. <clears throat> this way. And then I'm going to send them through here. In the underground belt there. Uh, uh, this needs to rotate to that way. So it's not being taken. And then this can go there. And then I need some underground belts. I need one there and I need one down here. Because what I'm going to do, I'm going to change this. That's the bit that's going to change. That can go down there. And I can use an underground belt here to work how far can it go. There. Which is pretty much perfect. And then I could just send that under. Then send this one under there, and that's now got them. They are there, ready to do. And all I need to do is just put this one there, like that. And that will now start making our, th our stack inserters, which is brilliant. And that's now that's yeah, it's going to start making the um, they're the stack filters, and then the basic stacks. That's how they work. They, they, these didn't used to exist, and I've not really used them. So now we can start researching some of this in these stack bonuses. But I'll do them offline. Now then, what's a decent thing for us to do? Logistic system. This is something very useful for 
something we'll need later on. But here, uh, I want to get everything I need for thingy. Uh, these are pretty decent, but these are quite expensive as well. You need, for one of these, you need 10 energy shields and 10 process. So you need 10 of the ones we've just researched, essentially, 10 of these. Uh, and they, they, we can actually make them now, but we can't make the armor because we need the um, processing units, and we're going to do them next episode. Um, so what's probably the best thing for us to do now? Hmm. Uh, you know what? This military three. That's a very decent one for us to do because we can start getting poison capsules, which essentially you put them down, you put like a set of three, and make a big giant cloud of smoke. That will it will degrade health over time, and apparently they are very effective against worms, especially since they stay in one area. So that's an idea for them. And then you have slow down capsules, and these essentially you put them down as well, and it was it, it does pretty much it's pretty much what it says on the tin or on the capsule. It slows down your biters and your spitters. And then you get the combat shotgun, which is freaking amazing. So I'm going to get that on. This shouldn't take long. It's only got 50, so that'd be a nice one to do. And we need to find out how much, what they take as well, so we can put them where we, where they need to go. They might go up here. I might have to send them down this end. But ah, that's one thing I forgot to do. Let's change this because we're out of this now. So I'm going to change this to advanced. We're going to get more for our money there, and I can't reach. Still can't reach there. So this needs now requires water. And typically it's on the wrong freaking side. As I knew it probably would be. Um oh, Right, um right, I'll do that in a different one. Typically it's the opposite to what I have put it in. Oh yeah, well, I'm gonna... There, 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 right. Let's do it this way. Um, so we put that one there. And then we can put the underground belt. I'm going to press X to swap it over. Uh, then we need that one there. Uh, that one may as well be a thingy belt. Right, this can go that way and that can go there. No, no, not grenades. Pipes. Oh, I've dropped one. Like that. That's fine there, and we need water over this side. So let's just let's just yeah, work over here first. Um, unfortunately, this is wrong. Oh, military's done. I'll show you those eventually. Um, hmm. Uh, um, logistics starts a bit later. Um, we could get them on now. Uh, no, we can't. We need speed modules. Forget that. Ah, grenade damage. That's why did I? I've not done that. Oh, I've been messing about with other stuff, haven't I? And we get military four. Which will get us piercing shotgun rounds, and they are insanely awesome. So, hmm, let's throw that on. And there's something I want to show you after that as well. Right, this is gonna go. Uh, this I need to reroute this. Um, so let's do that now. Up there. Now then, um, shift one. Uh, I want that there. And uh, oh, not that far there. <coughs> And this can pretty much be nice and easy to that. And then this one, hmm, that's not so bad actually. I could put a, um, a standard shift, shift. Make sure you're holding shift. And I can do that. And then put that there. There it goes quite a distance, but no matter. There, um, shift one, shift two. <clears throat> underground, just put it about there, that'll do water's going through that now but that's come from the opposite direction, that it shouldn't have been but no matter um, there, that's now on and now is that one That's both. they're both on now, but we need to get some water down here, and that's going to be a pain in the ass well it isn't really but <clears throat> it's more of a pain in the ass than it should be now these ones, um, we're going to do essentially what we did with the other ones and put standard ones and then the underground runway. There, 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 then straight up to where we need to, but 
Um, this side. The half fork on this go. There to there, and then we can rotate that way. Then put that in. Is that is that done it? No, because I put that in the wrong place. Damn it. Uh, there, that's where it needs to go. Now there's water in it. And now that one's going to start working. And this will make a lot more petroleum gas for us to use. Out of all the very little oil we have. So then, um... Yeah, I suppose that should about do it for this episode then. He, um... I think I've got what we needed to do. We've got that. Um, I'm probably going to get some of um, We've got these now making, which is very nice. We've got to me uh, new coal, a new coal supply once this is ran out, and it's very low at the moment. It's struggling. I mean, look at it's. It, unfortunately, it's the coal, it's the power which is struggling with. But that one's gone. That one's gone. That's gone. That's gone. Don't need those belts now. These belts can be trans transferred. Oops. There. Don't need the underground belt. There. Um, that's got 93 that will stop soon so yeah this is on full time now and it's not going to last much longer um, so when this is gone it's 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 virtually dead but he, um, this is essentially just going to rotate sideways rotate this direction that's probably a bit there hmm. I don't know we'll figure out how long it's going to take when it runs out but uh, I'm gonna run over a lamppost. There we go. I'm gonna sort of wait for this, wait for this skill out, and this one. Oh, what's got blown up? Right. Um. See, this is why I wanted the um, things on because of the. Um, Basically, things are starting attacking this, and it's just blown up a turret. So that's why I want to get these on. Um, this shouldn't take too long now. Um, I might put an extra one in the middle just to speed it up. This one's gone, so now we've got all this. This can go. Don't need any of this here. This can go. Get rid of it. Get rid of it. Go. 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 Nope. 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 Don't need that. Don't need that. Nope. 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 Oh no. Need that one. I need. Uh, there, need that one. That can go. <clears throat> and just for the sake of... There we go. That's what we need. So yeah. <clears throat> it is struggling. Look at it now. Um, in fact, that's partly struggling because it's using it so somewhere. We, it, yeah. It's busy mining out all that coal. So we, we do need some more power. So as soon as this is gone, I'm going to get some on. So... Yes, thanks for watching. Um, here's some coal coming out right now. So yeah, thanks for, thanks for watching. Leave us a like if you like this episode. Subscribe to see some more. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.